It is time to show you some of this morning's headlines from around the globe. The New York Times looks at a study on economic mobility. It found that chances of moving up or down the economic ladder in this country are the same 20 years later. The report's authors say that although the odds haven't changed, the lack of opportunity is alarming. The Los Angeles Times looks at an engineer accused of trying to smuggle classified material on America's F-35 stealth fighter to Iran. Mazafar Kazai is an Iranian-American. He worked at Pratt & Whitney, where the engines are made. Authorities claim he traveled with boxes of classified material labeled household goods. The Washington Post says new surveillance blimps are causing privacy concerns. They'll fly at 10,000 feet, about 45 miles northeast of Washington. The goal, spotting potential threats to the nation's capital. Blimps used in Afghanistan also carry powerful surveillance cameras. The Miami Herald says pop star Justin Bieber was arrested last night in Miami Beach for drunk driving. The Miami Beach Police Department confirms on Twitter Bieber was taken into custody for both DUI and drag racing. He was in a Lamborghini. <laughs> and our San Francisco station KPIX looks at California's severe drought. A UC Berkeley professor who studied three rings warns it could be the driest winter in 500 years and the drought could last decades.